The flood stage for the river was expected to rise 43.8 feet earlier today, and city officials are urging anyone who's in those affected areas to prepare for the floods. You know, property is not valued higher than life. We want to make sure we can make, preserve life over anything else. Sometimes they want to wait it out, and uh, we've seen that. Uh, we, we discourage against that because obviously, again, property is not valued. You can replace property in our life. Jefferson County Sheriff Lafayette Woods says flood stage water levels were at 31.6 feet Thursday, which was higher than normal, with rainfall Sunday expected to rise 42. We sit somewhat of a bowl, if you would, and so we get the, uh, the uh, water from upstream coming downstream to us. Affecting key places like Swan Lake Recreation Road, Island Harbor Estates, Knott's Island Road, the Riverside Addition west of Lake Langoffer, and even Regional Park. That's where Cedric Hunt says his family and friends couldn't enjoy their usual park visits just Saturday. Well, it was flooding down the river, down the regional, and uh, they asked us to leave from down the RV park at 12 yesterday. Then at 345, they would go shut down the whole park because of the river started rising. It's not supposed to crest to today. It's expected to crest or recede Monday. As for preparations from those used to the weather. Uh, I understand that the precautions are being taken, so just uh, assuming that those are going, you know, those precautions are going to hold and stand true. Uh, we just lean on that. Now, keep in mind, you never want to drive a vehicle through flooded waters. In case there's an emergency, dial 911. Reporting in Jefferson County, Jay Jackson, THV 11 News.